This is just a quick video to show my induction testing with my DR SSTC system. We got a coffee can which has a lot of rust in it. That's just in the middle on top of the wood so don't burn up the Lexan if it gets too hot. Very accurate of course. And the thing with my system is once in a while if you don't start it right it won't actually escalate. There we go. So this is not a cycles uh, I'm running for this test at least. Every division on here is two volts, which means one division is 200 amps. So right now we're running at 200 amps. And then you can see the waveform it might be hard to see is kind of flittering. And that's because my um, interrupter has a weird phasing mode, I call it. So this is now. 400 amps primary current that dot is 8 amps so we're only at about 4 amps right now running at about 110 volts so this coffee can obviously gets really hot hot enough that you can melt the crayon or whatever Apparently some water in that can because I can hear it popping, but I'll now redo the tests, but this time I'll do a little bit more cycles. So now that my room smells like crayons, I'll once again try to escalate it. Something I gotta fix because I have no clue why it does this. It seems to go when you kick it up to like 30 amps, then it will finally start escalating. But you can see there's a little jittering. I might need to turn the brightness down. You can see a ghosting of two forms. But once you get more amps, it starts going to more solid. And most of the issue is the interrupter, actually. Running now at 400 amps. Drawing about. 7 to 8 amps at 110 volts again. Use a thermometer. As you can tell by the sounds, it does make weird flinching every once in a while. But again, I think that is the interrupter. So now it does it when I turn it a little higher. Running maximum 8 amps on my Variac, so I'm sure it's happy. And our can is our fishy smoking right now. And I'm not sure if that's the crayon or if that's the water. For those who can't see it, using a little laser beam to show that there's smoke coming out of it. Quite a lot. I 
And it has a mixed smell of crayon and water vapor. Probably metal actually overheating because it's, it's, I don't, I don't know. Yeah, it's hot. So that's my DRSSTC for inductor heating. First time I actually got the can to actually smoke that much. But yep, it works. And later I'll eventually plug in the main coil and see what it does. So thanks for watching.